So at the end of the day, when you think about it, someone you love, especially when you're someone who loves himself, someone you love calls you and asks you something that's pertinent. It's pertinent. It's a pertinent situation. And they're upset and don't have time or the, the, the energy to fight the anger off to set up. See, upset is real simple. Turn it around. Set up. Look at why you're upset and set up for the upset so that it will be able, it will be easier to allow it to, allow it to roll off your back like water. Mm. A lot of people want to hurt somebody because they're hurt. Hurt people, yeah, hurt people. They say, I've seen it. So they don't have to say it. I've seen hurt people, hurt people. However, those hurt people who hurt people didn't realize at the end of the day, they would be hurt again after hurting those who hurt them. So you hurt me and I hurt you because you hurt me. And now I'm hurt because you hurt me and I hurt you. Pissed off. Okay, you were pissed off. So you tell me, you did this because you were pissed off. Sun didn't come out. It was raining. I ran out of blunts. I didn't have no more weed or whatever. Alcohol was gone. I didn't have my my med, my, my medication. The doctor told me he couldn't feel my strength. Whatever your excuse. Lost my job. Somebody got me fired. Always somebody gets us fired. We forget that we play a role in it. So I got myself fired because I allowed someone to manipulate me into anger or getting upset or pissed off. This is going to be a short one, guys. Instead of getting pissed off, focus on how being pissed off might just cause you to be the one to be pissed on. I repeat, being pissed off and you lacking the fortitude and the wherewithal on how to embrace and deal with that, you'll go from being pissed off to being pissed on by your damn self. Let that sink in. Let it marinate. Peace.